So if you come over here, I'll your ass. Gear up for a binge-worthy selection of the top Karen and Kevin clips that will leave you glued to your screen. Yeah, Karen, you really caught him recording you while you recorded him and also tried to hit him. <laughs> How is he in the wrong? Dirty. Hey, you gotta get your girl. No, he recorded me. Wow. Yeah, I'm recording no, myself. No, 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 exactly no, what I'm doing. No, That's exactly no, what I'm doing it for. Exactly what I'm doing it for. Why is the problem? Because he tried to sit here. It's common knowledge. It's common knowledge. People have watched him all day. He told me. So you. You come here. You think I'm just gonna sit there and take it? You're gonna sit there and call me a bitch. You're gonna sit there and call me a bitch. You're gonna sit there and call me I have self-respect for myself, all right? All right, cool. Don't come at me. Come at people yelling at him like that. Call them. Then I expect to be called a bitch, all right? You call me. Don't act like a no, people will call you. you Simple as that. There's your Philly. Take your Philly and get out. Take your Philly. And yeah. Are you the three embarrassing you yourself, I look at you. You're embarrassing you yourself. Post it? I'll post it everywhere. I'll post it everywhere. I'll post it everywhere. I'll post it everywhere. A Karen drunk on an airplane. That is the unholy trifecta if I've ever heard one. Every time. Can't you just sleep on the plane like a regular person? We'd all be way better off. One plane to another. This guy sounds like a South Park caricature. I know you're not gonna be getting on this flight, sir. I'm, on, we I'm need not doing it. The There's a the dangerous off. one. You're crazy. Right, sir, you're care. crazy. Sir. I'm not leaving sir. ever. Sir. I'm putting my belt on. They all know. Sir. You fly the plane now. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna deplane this aircraft. Hi. Find the plane now. These blacks are hijacking. Hell yeah! Get up! Get up! Now! Now you know! Don't! Wait, fight! Fly the plane! The black object! Fly the plane! Now! Damn right! Oh! And ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna deplane this aircraft. 
Ladies and gentlemen, this is Captain speaking. We're going to go ahead and deplane the airplane. We have a maintenance issue also that needs to be corrected, so everybody gather your stuff and uh, deplane the airplane this minute. Thank you for your cooperation. French fries are amazing, but they're not worth freaking out about like this. I can't give you something you can't. You, I can't give you something you haven't paid for, man. I did pay, if you want it, all. I can charge you for it. If not, I can't give it to you, man. What's your I name? I understand that's what you asked for, but he didn't charge you that. So if you that's want, that's not me, my I can problem. That's it. not my problem. Or else you gotta get out the line. That's I my gotta, problem. That's not my problem. All right, I'm just trying to do my job. You're not doing it right. Yeah, but I, I'm, yes, I am. If you didn't not. charge you for it, I who's, I who's the manager? I got a charge. Who's the manager? Out free food, huh? Who's the manager? The manager, her name's Estan. Why well, she not on shift right she's now? She's in the kitchen. She's she's making. What have her? What have her come up here? Huh? How the manager come up here? I don't know why you're talking to me right now. Hello. Hi there. Your employees are very disrespectful in this video. I will be sending. I will be sending this video to the owner. Okay. There's a uh, one is more fries, one double cheese, two large fries. Cheese, two large fries. Yes, I ordered three large fries, one small fry, okay. and then uh, two double cheese one burgers. One large fry? I ordered two large fries. You can, no, that's not. This I want a refund. Just give me my money back. Two ninety one. Give me. No, I don't care. Give me, I, I just want my money back now at this point. I want a refund. Okay. No, I want a refund. I said I wanted a refund. No, no, no. Oh, you, you're not gonna give me a refund? Y'all see this? You know, y'all see this? Extra last try. Extra last try. If y'all move out the way, we're gonna have to call the laws. Well, call the police because y'all stealing my money. I want a refund. Okay, we're gonna contact the owner. I want a refund. You supposed to give a person a refund. So you stealing my money? Her name is Estelle, too. Your name is Estelle? Okay. This was a Philly Cheese Mistake Special. Never face a comedian in a battle of words. You will lose every time. I oh, know, I'm getting old, I'm 26 now, right? But I was recently, what, well, sorry? New Jersey. That explains that you're American. <laughs> like this moment, it's about me. And then someone tells you to shit up, you're like, that is my right, okay? I can say what I goddamn want. I know you're not Southern, but it's funny. Right? <laughs> Why did you say that? Oh, right, because I said I'm 26. Right. I, I read. <laughs> McDonald's has meth on their menu, and this guy's giving them out like Happy Meals. What's up, man? I'm on the way up out to see Creed at the hospital. I'm on, on my way up out to see Creed at the hospital. He's sick and coming down from all that goddamn meth you've been getting. Have you got Have you got any that we can take up our year to him? Sure. Sure, buddy. This only started. You hear what I'm saying? You hear me? Yeah, you, mother. You give my goddamn 18-year-old son drugs, you going to get it, boy. 44 years old, you won't give an 18 year old mess. I'll bring, I'll bring here to McDonald's. Yeah, well, won't you, you drug test the Okay, but there's children. Yeah, here. yeah, they don't need to be in here eating that back there cooking the food for them. Call them. 
call them. I agree with you. It's all right. I can't hear you stand up for it. My son's at the hospital. We're up there having a detox and to take you to a drug rehab because he's got him hooked on meth. He's in here cooking everybody's food. Call him. He's in here. He's in here. You heard what the lady said. She said, stand up for my son. That's what she just said. Is that not what you said, ma'am? That's what she said. Med head. Med head. This lady really just wanted her shift to be over, and instead, she got this. At Arby's on in Winder. So I ordered my food, and it took them 15 minutes to get my order. I canceled my order because it took so long to get my order. Nobody came and brought me my order, so I wanted a refund. As soon as I tell them I want a refund, they bring the food. I saw two people behind me go past me, and you're telling me I can't get a refund. And what's your name? Bethany. Bethany. So I can't get a refund, Bethany. I can replace your food. I don't want my food replaced. I just want a refund. I want my money back. Because y'all service was horrible. It took y'all 15 minutes to give me my food. I'm working right now. So I just want a refund. That's all I'm asking for. Just want my money back. I just gave you guys my money. So it shouldn't be that hard to give me my money back. Uh, you have a manager and you're the are you the manager okay so if you're the manager you can give me a refund now if y'all want to go famous on tiktok and make your business go down because you don't want to give me a refund because you don't tell me you can't give me a refund and i don't want the food now i can replace so, it for you i don't want my food replaced i want the money i want my money back that i just gave y'all literally 15 minutes ago that you had me sitting in this line for it you serve two people behind me, and I'm not leaving this line until I get my refund. And y'all's line will be backed up. Well, they got their way. What you say? You gotta be a star. Like this line will be backed up till I get my refund. Y'all already wasting my time. I'm working. I would never come back to this place again. This woman just told me she couldn't give me a refund. Wasting my time and now she's going in there getting my money. But she just told yeah, me she couldn't do I'm this. Trouble, so take your money and well, you're definitely going to get more than in trouble. And oh. do what? Do, get out the line and do it. Karens don't have music in their soul. Want some proof? Uh, religion you're allowed to do anywhere. No, miss. You're not allowed you to are. sing ch you uh, are. Songs, church you are. songs outside of church grounds, by the way. You're not allowed to sing church songs outside, outside of church, or church, uh, songs or church you're not allowed grounds. To, that's fine. That's you're not fine. allowed. She just said you're not allowed to sing church songs outside of church. Our church of, outside of church grounds, unless you have a uh, unless that's you have been authorized no, no. by the church to do this yes, kind of song. Are oh, you saying that you don't care about the Human Rights Act? You're lost? Hmm. Somebody get this lady a rage room. Why don't you stand on you? Why don't you right here? Who is? She got she got time today. She got time today. What? And let me tell you something. I don't let me tell you something. Here. Really? I, no. Really? She don't work here. She don't work here, baby girl. She going crazy. They got a lot of cleaning. They got a lot of cleaning. This store, it don't be like. Oh, that was the thing right there. Oh. Yo, you going to jail, yo. Go get some blood, some cigarettes. Get some blood for us. Hey, throw oh, some new boys. Honestly, I could see this being therapeutic. It's a shame these workers have to clean up after her temper tantrum.
goddamn wham, bro. Hold the wham. Give me a bag. Give me a bag. Why are you snapping, baby girl? What's wrong? They go to India. You sure? Yeah. Not like this. Not like this, though. I'm getting out of here. Y'all judges, y'all parole officers, crooks. All of them crooks. Where you from? I'm from Suffolk. Suffolk. Y'all born and raised. Suffolk, North Suffolk, the whole 757. They're all crooks. She doesn't even look like she's having fun doing it. So it's like, why are you doing it? Go get some blacks and cigarettes. Get some blacks for her. Ain't it? Oh, some new boys. Throw some new boys, <laughs> <laughs> baby girl. You gotta throw new boys. Black of miles. That wood. Ain't it? You gonna say that? Hey, baby girl, where Yo, you going? Yo, look at this. Yo. Yo, <laughs> Yo she done f got them stoked. Slam. Uh. Uh. She f this stoked. Uh. Man, you, you could have been gone. People, can you could have been gone. Up and walk dead out this. Wow, this is The Burger King's ice cream machine is down. What does it think? It's a McDonald's machine. So, you served that customer over there minutes ago, but you won't serve me because the machine's down. Is that correct? You know anything about that, buddy? You just serve this person right here. But now that I walk in and I'm white, you won't serve me. Is that correct? I want to know why you won't serve me. Why all of a sudden the machine broke down? The machine he's fixing, all three, all t two of them broke down. Is that correct? But you're using it right now. Is that correct? That's off and that's off. I'm going to make it easier. Either you leave, right? Either you leave and have an amazing day. Right, and we don't have to call the cops, or we'll just call the cops. And tell them you won't serve me because I'm white. Yeah, I, I'm no, just not, bro, you're trying to make this over racist. Bro, I'm Hispanic. There's a lot of, she's black. How the f is that racist? Huh? I don't know, you tell That's me. me bro. I simply walked in. No, 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 no. She got served a minute ago, but now you're telling me I can't be served. It doesn't work, because sometimes it goes on and it comes off. I don't know why. We're burking, we're broken in the All right? Okay. Alright, uh, y'all broke his. Yes, alright. Let's end this off properly with a very satisfying series of videos. Huh? <laughs> you pulled out a gun, Tom. Look at these dumb. Dumb. Well, here we are at Lincoln Park City Hall because I got some petty neighbors. I'm tired of dealing with it, so we're about to figure out exactly what the. I can and can't do, and y'all are about to see me be petty as f pettier than I've ever been in my life. You're about to see it. All right, I'm gonna try to make a long story very short. So, they made a whole fit. They had the city come out twice to put up no parking signs because I parked like over there for one day when I went to go buy my kid their bike. I parked my van over there for one day. All right, they called the cops, reported that as suspicious. Since then, they've been calling the cops every other day, having the city come out. Now, and these aren't even these people aren't even on my block, right? That's her house, this one right here. She was just sitting in front of that car, just staring at it. 
because I moved it there to the city hall and, and the police station to find out the legality of it. And I can park in front of her house. I can park in front of his house on that side of the street. Those two are the one, are the problem. But she wanted to chime in and be the problem. So now I'm going to be the problem. And backstory, my van is in the backyard at all times. This one's out here. That one's in the backyard unless I use it, which I used it to go pick up that little bike for County. And it stayed over there for one day. She called the cops report. It's suspicious. Whatever. Cops came knocking my door at 3 in the morning and tell me that. Whatever. So then they had the city come out and put up this no parking sign. And then they had the city come out and put out this no parking sign on two different occasions because I was parked over there, right over there, where nobody even parks there. But, you know, I can be petty. So now she's just sitting and staring at that car that I moved there. So now I'm going to sit and I'm going to stare at her, stare at that car. And we're going to do this. I can be petty. I got time i don't got time but i'm gonna make time this man is looking to claim the crown for king of pettysburg oh yeah and she's parked illegally if you don't think that i called the city of lincoln park to let them know that there's an illegally parked car there because she's taking up two spaces like i don't know all i know is i'm gonna have a lot of fun with this that's the only thing i know if you want to be petty i can be pettier if you want to be a neighbor i can be worse let's do this things weren't always like this i was like i think she's 60 she's a little bit older but, you know, if I see her unloading groceries, I pull the car over and I say, hey, can I help you with those? And I've actually helped her unload her groceries before. Now she's going to do that all by herself. I hope you stub your toe, too. Best believe I got my rocking chair out here. Come on, man. I'm about this life. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's the police. My knights in shining armor. Full disclaimer, I am not about wasting police resources. I 100% am not. But... She's got to learn a lesson somehow. And there goes Carmen. <laughs> telling them about me parking in front of her house. Let's go. I'm ready. Oh, and he gave her a ticket. He gave her a ticket. Yes. <laughs> yes, baby. Yes. Just got done talking to my knight in shining armor. You cannot have your left wheel on the curb. Left wheel has to be on, on the street. She got a ticket because she with the wrong neighbor she complained about me parking there because they made a whole ordeal about me parking there i feel like lessons were learned don't f with me that seems like that's where the story should end but what if i told you there was a sequel disclaimer they called the cops and the city at least 10 times on me before i finally made a move back so you, you keep pushing and something's gonna happen <laughs> she just drove by my house and... <laughs> oh man what a good day you just hit my car, Doug? Did you just hit my car? Did you just hit my car? You sure? It looked like you just hit. It looked like you just hit my car. Really? Is this what we're doing? You called the. You, I tried to be nice too. You called the cops on me again? I didn't call the cops. Two days ago, man. I, didn't call the cops. I put my I put my my truck right here to move my car out the driveway. The cops pulled up to my house. Well, I didn't call. Who did then? It's me. You pissed everybody off. Who? Ain't nobody off. here mad besides you three. Nobody. Well, so Nobody's mad about me taking my kid and the neighbor's kids on go kart rides in the field besides you. Nobody's mad about right. parking. You done called the city twice. What? To have them put up signs out here? You know I legally could park there, but I don't. Where? Where? Right here. Right in front of your house. I could. And I don't. Exactly. Yeah, but y'all had a problem with me parking here, so not would you rather me park there? Hey, Vic, that was your with them. No, it wasn't, man. I tried to be cool with you, dude. I tried to be cool with you, but you just won't move by doing that. You called the cops on me again, Tom. I don't like that car there that puts up my grass cutting and shit. It was there for a day. Before she called the cops. That was you that's how it all started with you. Oh, don't worry. That's not the end. I said satisfying, and I mean it. Yo. So CJ parked over there, look, she, you see the bicycle? See it? She parked right on your bumper, look. She put the bike behind your car. <laughs> do you see it? What is she planning to do with I the bike? I don't know. What's happening? CJ, I can't see. Is she chaining the bike to the pole? Is that what's happening? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, one apology and this all goes away. This all goes away after one apology. Anyway, I want you to know, I called the hall. They're gonna put a no, no trespass sign on the field. Okay. And, but I'm in the middle. Hey, I told her one apology and this goes away. Well, but here's the thing. Show me. My neighbor just 
pointed a gun at CJ in Austin for parking the car in front of his house. <laughs> No, no, no. Are you brandishing a firearm right now? Hold on. I need to see this. Hold on. Don't get too close. Are you brandishing a firearm? So at this point, you might be wondering why we were even over there in the first place. We were about to go bowling, so we only went over there to grab CJ's bowling bag out of his car. We thought it might be better to do it this way instead of asking her to move her car or her bicycle in an effort to avoid conflict. Huh? You pulled out a gun, Tom. So now, instead of one cop, it's a whole squadron of them. Hold on, one more time, Carmen. So I, huh? <laughs> Damn. Damn. Damn, move your damn car, move your car, move your car, Karen, move your car, Karen, move your car, Karen, move your car, Karen. sorry, sorry, hey, stay safe, Karen, let me put some out there for all the newcomers to my Snapchat, I did not start, I was pushed and with 20 times before I finally retaliated. None of my neighbors, not one single neighbor has anywhere on my block has a problem with me. The only neighbors that have problems with me don't even live on my block. They across the street for one. For two, I didn't take nobody's parking spot. I was parked near where they park. And the fact that I even parked close to them just drove them insane. Nobody owned street parking. I could have been more petty, but I wasn't. And now, the thrilling conclusion. What'd you say? You heard me. You keep me. No, you keep my, my Hey, don't get, my right don't get close to me. Don't get close to me. I ain't gonna touch it. Don't get close to my me. My garbage is there. They can't pick it up. Hey, what, what time does that say for garbage day? It doesn't matter. What they time does that say for up. garbage day? 8.30 to 11.30? Yeah, well, then why her car is there at that time? Let's okay. move now. Good morning. So you can't park there at 12.30, 3.30. Can't park here at 8.30 to 11.30. It's 12.30 now, so I can't park there. So I moved it right here. And I got yelled at by this woman. Hey, I hope you have a good day, Carmen. I'm going to pray for you, okay? I love you too. I don't know if y'all can see, but there she is calling the cops for my van that is legally parked because it's garbage day. Uh-oh. wonder what she's doing to it. Maybe I should go investigate. I'm scared, though. That's it. So you don't want to smooth this over? You're going to keep calling the cops? I will call the cops every time she's parked here on garbage day. Because I can make sure all my cars are parked here. And I can make sure. <laughs> what What can yeah. you make sure? Threaten me, Carmen. You, you know, you're a little shrimp. Little, ugh. <laughs> this, is, this is insane. You know this is insane, right? You started it. You did. You had him arrested, too. For what? For nothing. Pulling a gun on my he friends? On yeah, he did. Why the you get arrested down. then? No. Don't talk to me. Yeah, I tried to solve this you like an adult. No, you don't. You want to be a child? How old are no, you? You're the child, little Grow boy. up, Carmen. You need to grow up. Loser. Click the video on screen to watch more Wild Karen moments.